Hi everyone, I hope you're all okay. Today we're going to look at five letters and that will complete our alphabet then. We'll have done all of our letters. And today we're going to have a look at the letter M. So M, N, N, Y, Y, X, X and Z, Z. Okay, so there's five letters to look at today. So let's have a go. So the letter M, hold your paper like I've shown you to do, so your paper doesn't move. And the letter M is going to sit in between our grey lines. It is not a tall letter and it's not a descender. It doesn't go under the line either. So start on the line, you sweep up to the grey line, back down, back up on the same line and you scoop over. Then you go back over and you exit. Try and keep these two bits the same distance apart because it'll make it look neater. Nice even finger space and then we're going to go again up, down to the first grey line, back up to the top grey line and round, down to the grey line, back up to the other grey line, back down to the other grey line and a little exit. I think my first one was better. So we'll try again and as we've done before make sure you try and make each one better and better. That's better, isn't it? You can see. So we sweep up, down, over, over, exit. There we go. So there's the letter M. The letter N or N is easier than the M because it's only got one up and over. So it's the same pattern as the M. You go up to the grey line down to the grey line, back up on the same line and you go over and exit. That's nice and easy isn't it? So up, down, up and over. Go up, down, up and over. One more time. Up, down, up and over. There we go the letter N. The letter Y, that is a descender, it goes down under the line so you must make sure that the body of your Y is sitting on the bottom grey line and the tail, the bit that goes under the line, goes under down to the red line. So you start on the line and you go up, back down on the same line and you scoop round and back up. Then you come down on the same line and you go down, 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 and then you scoop round. Okay, watch again, because this one's a bit trickier. Go up to the grey line, you scoop round, back up to the grey line and down. It's a bit like writing the letter U that we did the other day. Then you come down to the red line and scoop round. And I said before to keep the body of the Y on the line, that's what I mean. Because sometimes I see Y sort of flying high in the sky, all the way up here, and the, the body isn't sitting on this line. So let me show you again. You go up, scoop round, up, down, 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 scoop round, and exit. One more time, go up to the first grey line, scoop round all the way to the grey line again come straight down scoop round well done the next letter we're going to look at is the letter x now this one is very strange it's like two c's backwards so you start on the line and you go up and you go all the way round then you're allowed to take your pencil off and you go around the other way. That's strange, isn't it? So you go up and round like a letter C, but it's kind of a backwards C, and then you go back round like that. One more time. Round, round. Oh, sorry, maybe I'll do it one more time for you. So you go up and curl round, 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 and you go back round. <laughs> We'll try and do that in a join in a minute, I think. And the last letter is the letter Z. And this one sits in between your grey lines too. And it goes up, straight line, 
down at an angle and back at an angle. Show you again. So you go up, across, down at an angle to the other grey line and back across. That one's better than my first one. Up, across, down at an angle and across. One more time. Up, across, down at an angle and across. There we go. So I think the X and the Z are probably the trickiest ones today. So let's have a go at writing something with those letters in, shall we? Should we have, um, instead of fox, should we have zox? Z, ox. Because we did the letter O the other day, didn't we? So that'll help us practice that as well. So zox, here we go. Start on the line, you go up, across, down at an angle, and across. Then you're going to go up into your O, round, back round on the same line, and then your X, <laughs> you're allowed to take your pencil off for the X, there we go, Zox. Try again. Z, O, and that O to the X is tricky. I think joining the O is definitely a tricky join. So you can just have a go at doing O, X if you want to. So that's the end of your handwriting practice again today. Well done for all your hard work. I know you're working really, really hard at school and at home. So well done, keep it up. I look forward to seeing all your wonderful photos a bit later of your beautiful handwriting and we can share them with Mr Clark and Mr Taylor and pop them on Twitter for you. So take care and enjoy the rest of your day year too. Bye now.